Libra, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. My name is Jen Dawson, welcome to Jen TV. All right, Libra, yeah, I'm wearing a wig today. <laughs> not bad for 20 quid from Amazon, is it? I'll not take the hat off because then you'll see how crap it actually is. But, but uh, yeah, with a hat on, not too bad, eh? Anyway, Libra, this is your love reading. I'm having an identity crisis. I can't figure me out yet, but I think I like hair. I'm gonna grow my hair. My hair grows like a weed, so it'll be about two years before it's this long. Not too bad. All right, Libra. What do you need to know about love? What guidance has the universe got for you in love? Bear in mind my loves. These are general readings, so it's not gonna resonate with all of you. But if it does, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. You can also purchase them via my website, gentvtarot.com. Or if you uh, join my channel. Each has its own perks, but the best price might probably be from Patreon. Libra, what do you need to know about love? This is the shuffle. What does Libra need to know about love? I just heard you fall in love too easily. Perhaps a little bit in, in love with the idea of being in love. Um, bottom of the deck, avoiding conflicts. Five of, five of wands in reverse, avoiding conflicts. So I sort of feel like a little connection here, page of cups here. For the overall vibe of the reading, a little connection has come up a little bit out of the blue. And you're like holding on to it, like, oh, I like this. Relax, take a step back. This is the energy you need to be having right now. I'm not falling in love too easily, but come on, take a step back. It's early days. I can see that. It's early days. So have a deep breath. Tell yourself, I'm not in love with this person. I'm not in love with them. I don't want them. I'm not interested in them. I just, I'm rather in love with the idea of being in love. Take a step back and then see them for what they really are. Try and see them for what they really are. This is you. This is your current energy. Is You need to be drinking from your own cup. And see that shell behind her? You need to be protecting yourself from the elements. Otherwise known as love. Protecting yourself from heartbreak. What does Libra need to know right now? Yeah, but this is not your person. They're not yours. They, you, you've, you've kind of gone for them. Like, oh, I've latched on. It's not your person. Nope. It might be nice to talk to them, but they're not your person. Okay. Take a step back. I advise you. A little moth just came in. Don't be eating my cashmere sweaters, mate. That I got in charity shops. Go to the posh part of town, right? Go into the charity shops. That's all I'm gonna say. I got the best, the best cashmere sweater for 16 pounds. About $12, something like that. Right. Something else. Libra needs to know right now. It might be nice to talk to them. It might be nice to, you know, they're not, this is not a relationship for you. Okay. We've got the six of, um, you, you guys see that moth? Look, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> so get out of here. <laughs> that way. Oh no, I'm not really going to kill it. I don't kill the spiders and things. I'm so spiritual. Yeah. 
but we've got the uh, five of cups in reverse and just I'm, I'm i'm still feeling like this is projecting onto this person because you want it to be them it's not them okay I feel else I'm going to that right now. Four of Cups in reverse. Uh, I sort of feel like you, you might get some communication from this person, but uh, they're going to remain somewhat... Uh, what's the words I'm looking for? They're going to keep you at arm's length. Anything else? Anybody needs to know right now. Uh, witchy styles today. The garden and the gate. See, she's sort of like, she's got an awesome garden there. She's kind of looking out like, oh, what's out there? What's, what could possibly be out there? It's a little bit scary out there. I would say, you know, maybe it's time to open the gate and step out of your comfort zone. Yeah. I think that you're projecting onto this person goodies that they don't have because you want it to be them and they can kind of are remaining somewhat in your comfort zone. Yeah. Third chakra, Archangel Shemuel. This is your sacral. It sort of feels like um, that's the part that needs to toughen up because that's why you fall in love so easily. It's, it's kind of open there and you let a lot of energy in that isn't yours. I feel like Balancing out that chakra, toughen it up. Anything else? Anybody needs to know right now. Fifth chakra, Archangel Gabriel. I'm picking up with that one because that's about the throat chakra. I'm kind of picking up with that one. Oops, sorry, kicking the uh, stand. I'm kind of picking up with that one uh, an energy of... Because also this person's remaining somewhat at arm's length and wanting to talk to someone, like the chase, the they're kind of pushing you in, you, you away and you're like, oh, I want this, I want to talk to them, I want them to talk to me, like, talk to me, I, I, I want this, this is what I want. <sighs> I just don't think this is your person. Moving on to the near future, we've got the seven of pentacles, but in reverse. It's not worth putting your energy into this, my loves. All the fraught, is that a word? I, I feel like it is, it, it is now, I've just made it up. Fraught energy, yearning, wanting. Um, It's all to naught. Go away, moth! Yeah, it's time to kind of start fresh for you. Stop putting in that energy where it doesn't belong. It's time to start fresh and, and um, start building your foundation what you want it to be this is can tend to be about teamwork but i just feel like he's building you know he's building and i, and I feel like this is you what do you want in your future because you don't want to be chasing after people you don't want to be yearning you want to 
get into a relationship where it's equal straight away, right? It's just bang, there you are. Communicating with each other, liking each other, right? This is you. And your Nine of Pentacles is about stability and standing in her power and not needing anyone to validate her worth because she already knows her worth. This is about give and take, about receiving what you put in and balance. This person isn't for you. Okay, Libra. You know why? Because this is the best you can hope for. It's just another bad cycle that you don't need. More of four of wands in reverse. Yeah, this is them. The magician. They're faking moves. They're not, you know, they're magicians trick you they they show you wonderful illusions and make you think that they're amazing and, and look oh wow look I, I can take off my thumb oh my god i didn't take my thumb off at all did i it was a trick this is what these guys are they they put out there that they're all that they're everything you've been looking for but they're not it's all an illusion. That's what they are. That's the energy they're putting out. And the outcome. I'm going to read the outcome, but then I'm going to take it into the extent where I'm going to ask about this person for you. Who are they? Like, what sign are they? How do they really feel about you? What are their intentions towards you? What do they want to say to you? And some guidance from the universe. But here is the outcome. Seven of Wands. It's just one problem after another, after another. This is not your person. It's just problems, problems, problems. Let it go. This is not your one. Clarify the outcome, please. It's just a whole lot of confusion and waiting 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 with this person confusion ah no it's not for you let's pull you a moonology oracle card Look at the bigger picture, right? Your love work for the day. All I can do by the cars. The idea of this is that this is a kind of person who pursues what they want. And then when they get what they want, they don't want it anymore. Once in a moment, it all comes to you. As soon as you get it, you want something new. It's all I can do to keep waiting for you. That's the kind of people you've been inviting into your life. We don't want that for you anymore. The royal we. No. I want you to be happy. So let it go. This is not for you. I'm going to take this into extended. Thank you for joining me. See you later.